everybody knows who that is. I shouldn't even have to say his name. Iconic in the diecast world. Uh, really cool guy to talk to too. Uh, him and I have chatted back and forth quite a bit on on uh, YouTube and whatnot. And really cool guy. Picker Nation. I have no. I think I might know maybe one thing that's in this box. <laughs> But I have no idea what else is in this box. So, Brad, now I have your address. I'm going to finish up your custom and explode your mailbox. I can promise you that. I will be returning fire, that's for sure. Uh, doesn't go unnoticed. And uh, we had talked about some things that you were interested in, in the past. Uh, but it's been quite some time. Uh, hit me up again. And some things that you might be interested in. This is awesome. PJ, enjoy, brother. Picker, Picker was here. <laughs> Let's read the back. Not sure if you still need the protectos. I always need protectos. Uh, but I tried using what I could for you. I'm sure you have seen me post pics of these customs on Facebook. Hope you dig them. They're two of my best yet. Two! Two! I did see one that uh, Brad posted on Facebook, and I made a comment on it. And it's okay if it's not in here. But uh, he knows which one I'm talking about. <laughs> what? What the hell is that? That is so cool. This is an M2 1953 Oldsmobile 98, but look, it's all clear. That is sick. <laughs> that is really cool. Man, that's awesome, Brad. I've never even seen this. What year did this come out? Uh, 2008, a little before my time. Before I started collecting. That is cool. Are those real riders? Nah. Look at it. It's all. It's got taillights and everything though. But it's all clear. That's really really cool. I'm going to spend five minutes just on this car. That's awesome. Thank you so much Brad. Bubble wrap. Oh boy. That says custom. So. Let's see what he's got in here. Should we save the customs for last? Nah. We'll just go in order unless he tells me something different. Thank you so much for the Protectos. I, I can always use Protectos. Uh, you watched it. A uh, video I haven't uploaded. I'm going to upload all my videos tonight. And uh, Lucas actually hooked me up with like 25 Protectos. We did a small trade. And uh, holy sh shit. Wow, dude, that is sick. You do use an airbrush, that's for damn sure. This thing is beautiful. Check out that paint job. What? Check that Impala out, dude. That is sick. Oh, it's not an Impala. I was just kidding. Cadillac. <laughs> Sorry, I'm holding it so far away. I'm just in awe of the paint job on this. Dang, that is beautiful. That is a 59 Cadillac. Look at them big whale tail fins on it. That is sick. Love those wheels. Nice wheel choice too. Matches the interior. Man, that thing is freaking awesome sick wow that's beautiful beautiful I love that glittery paint you gotta uh, make a video and let me know what kind of airbrush you use I am thinking about dang that's beautiful rolls perfect dang that freaking sparkles I gotta show it again <laughs> Look at that paint job. What? 
Dang, Brad, that is amazing. That is sweet. You should have signed a card or something. I want to display it. I'll definitely display it in my in my shelf. But I've got a little row of customs uh, working up here. Uh, signed by everybody. This is another custom. This one feels pretty heavy. <laughs> he told me this was already promised to somebody else. He had me going. And guess what? He lied to me because he shipped it to me. <laughs> Woo! That is freaking bad look at them flames that's a 83 Silverado he's seen my uh, base swaps I do on all the 83 Silverados I've got a nice collection I think almost all of them uh, except for a couple I think I'm missing the Valentine's Day one and an Edelbrock one which I think the Edelbrock's in, in this box but if not it's no big deal this is freaking amazing that is sick. Very, very nice. Look at That's right. Uses the rivets. Or the button head screws. That is sick. You got to show us the process, man. Oh, make a video uh, of what kind of airbrush you use. And uh, I would love to know because I'm thinking about probably investing in an airbrush... Uh, if not over the holidays, uh, right after the holidays. Uh, so, thinking about getting into airbrushing. Alright, what else we got here? What else we got? Nice. There's the 69 Copo Corvette. Flying Customs. Sick. I don't have a lot of Flying Customs, so this is really, really cool. Really, really nice piece. That's sick. Alright, put that down here. Sorry guys, I'm kind of taking my time. Blown away by these customs. That's awesome, Brad. That, you did an awesome job. I do have this one, though. This is a Hot Ones uh, Backwoods Bomb. I was thinking about using this camper on, a, on another truck or something else. Just turning it into a custom, but I'll do that with the... The other one I have. I think the other one that I have, the card's kind of ditched up on it. This one's really good condition. So thank you so much. That's cool. Love that backwoods bomb. I'm, I'm pretty sure I have one, but if not, that one ain't going anywhere. Uh, is another customs? Another custom? Another custom from Picker Nation? Or no, just a Lucy. Using them protectors. Very, very good. Very resourceful. Nice. This is one that I needed for my off uh, my off road collection, the Edelbrock. That thing is freaking heavy, metal and metal. I love that flat black. I've never seen one in person, and that is sick. I'm gonna try to get a close up of it. That's Edelbrock right there. That is one. Sick Silverado. That is nice. Love the paint job on it and everything. And I will be turning that into an off-road Silverado. That is awesome. Thank you so much, Brad. Alright. This is what I knew I was getting. That was it. <laughs> I, I was pretty sure I was going to get a custom, but two customs... That's sick. Mercedes CL55. This is Team Bartwell. Bartwell. That's nice. Those wheels. Those skinny wheels. Really, really cool. I never... One of 30,000. That's cool. I didn't know these came in this clamshell. That's pretty cool. Mercedes CL55. Look at those wheels. You don't see wheels like that. Hardly ever. That's cool. Thank you so much. 
Let's keep on going. I'm at 10 minutes. I better hurry it up. Huh. <laughs> Sick. This is the Hall of Fame Dan Gurney. Uh, this is the CUDA. I think it's a CUDA. Plymouth AAR CUDA. Pretty sure. Thought it would say it somewhere. But it doesn't. But I think it is the AR Cuda. That is sick. Nice paint job. I had a regular one of these and I traded it away. Uh, and it was a really nice piece. And this is sick. Look at those tires. Leather tires. Mmm. That's going to be hard not to rip open. <laughs> I love me some leather tires. Alright, what else we got? Nice. Ultra hot. Uh, Cobra 427. Dang, that's gorgeous. Anybody ever watch those Meekum auto auctions? And all those car shows? Uh, I was watching one the other day and they were talking about the, the kit of the Cobra. Uh, only cost like twenty or 30000 to build. That would be a cool build job. This is the Motor City... Chevy Chevelle. That is sick. I think I had one of these two and I traded it away. That is awesome. What year is that Chevelle? Uh, I'm not sure. A buddy of mine collects Chevelles. His dad actually has a Chevelle. And it's awesome. That's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Very well packed, man. I love the packing you did here. Everything's so organized, neat. Johnny Lightning Wolverine. Look at that truck. That truck is bad. I like trucks just like everybody, and that is bad. It's a Ford. Uh, not sure what year it is, but that is sick. Look at that. Wolverine. Whoosh. Sick piece right there. Really, really cool. Really, really cool piece. Ultra hot. Here's a Camaro. 67 Camaro. That is beautiful. Look at them fat meats all over it. Yeah, buddy. I could just zoom into that fat meat right there. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. Opening hood too. Really, really nice. Love me some Ultra Hots. You can sometimes find these at a really good price too. Uh, they don't make the Ultra Hots anymore. What year did they come out? 2005, 2006. Um, shop around for Ultra Hots. If you're looking for real riders, lots of times you can find these older uh, Ultra Hots. At a decent price, uh, depending on the casting, of course. I'm trying to hurry. I know I'm at 13 minutes. A couple of more bags to go through here. What? He sent me some real riders. Here's a stock car. I don't have this whole set. I don't even have any of them. I think I have one. I just got one the other day. Stock car set. This is a 57 Plymouth. That's sick. A 65 Ford Galaxy. That is sick. Love them black walls. Letter tires. Black wheels. Black on black. Sick. Beautiful. Star Trek. <laughs> Love them wheels. I will probably steal in those wheels. What we got here. Dang. Did you hook me up with the whole set? There's only six. And here's five in here. Awesome. 59 Chevy Impala. Check out the Impala. That is sick. Love these wheels, man. It's gonna, I will be hanging, hanging up this set because... Uh, I've shown a couple of pictures of my walls. I have all nostalgia and pop culture on this side. And that whole wall over there is nostalgia and pop culture. 
And I think I'm caught up on everything except for the new stuff that's coming out. Really, really sick. 66 Chevelle. Look at those yellow wheels. That is awesome. This is the one I got the other day. The 56 Merc. And of course, I'll double check before I crack one of them open. But that is sick. So there's five of them. What? <laughs> oh, shit. You're killing me, man. You're killing me. I haven't seen this set. And, uh, he bought a, I think he bought a whole case. And he's like, I'm going to send you some extras that I have. I don't have any of these. And, uh, it's probably going to be a couple of more weeks at least before they start hitting Walmart and Target and whatnot. This is the 51 GMC COE. Psychiatric help, five cents. Beautiful. Dang it. I'm going to get you back, Brad. Quick delivery. Little Halloween pumpkin wheels. It's all right. But the card art is what gets me on these all the time. Beautiful. They're cool. Uh, 56 Ford F100 panel. Just beautiful. Love them. And then the uh, Soda Popper. They renamed it. Really, really cool. Love it. Love it. So there's two I'm missing. The 64 GMC panel. And the Convoy Custom. Which I'm sure I'll find, hopefully. But thank you so much for giving me a head start. One more little bag here, guys. Let's get right to it. The 56 Ford Pickup Muscle Machines. Really, really cool paint job. Love me some trucks. Not too sure about a Ford, but... I want to know if anybody's ever tried to take some parts off a muscle machine and uh, use it on a Hot Wheels. Uh, on a Hot Wheels. I'm sure they have. I just haven't attempted it yet. Because these cars are like cartoony. Back in the day, Mad Magazine and everything, Hot Rod Magazine, 55 Chevy pickup. That Chevy is sick. Look at that blower on top. That's beautiful. Man, Brad, awesome, awesome, awesome. I'm so happy with this box. I can't thank you enough. Uh, obviously, my favorite two cars in here. Or this custom 83 Silverado. And this custom 59 Cadillac. That thing is beautiful. Look at that. I'm shaking. <laughs> that is freaking sick. Rolls perfect. That is awesome. Thank you so much, Brad. Man, these are freaking insane. Love that paint job. Love it. You do awesome work, man. Thanks for watching, Brad. I'm going to get you back. I got your address now. You just wait. You just wait. I'm going to get you back. I'm going to get you back. <laughs> That's awesome. The M2 I've never even seen. That is sick. This is sick. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'm going to go text Brad right now. Tell him he, he better be expecting a freaking whopper of a box that's for sure i gotta work on a few customs for him too you know gotta do it right thanks for watching guys uh, you guys have a safe week and uh